This day in history, June 10th, our story starts here. These men fought in World War II. Uh, some of you know who these famous soldiers are. For those who don't, Ted Williams on the left, Bob Feller, and Hank Greenberg, who left baseball in the prime of their Hall of Fame careers. President Roosevelt wrote to baseball commissioner Kennesaw Mountain Landis and said that even though we're at war, we still need baseball. That created an opportunity for many players who otherwise might not have been ready, like Joe Nuxhall. On June 10, 1944, Joe made history when he pitched for the Reds against the Cardinals. He was 15 years old. What? The youngest person to play Major League Baseball. That's him on the right. Nuxhall threw two-thirds of an inning. He gave up five runs on five walks, two hits, one wild pitch. Ooh. Again, 15 <laughs> years old. Wow. Uh, the good news, eight years later, he was back pitching for the Reds at the age of 23. In just a few years, Joe Nuxhall made the all-star team. Wow. So, got Gary, an opportunity. Every now and then, you pull out a nugget that I've yeah. never heard before. That's it's not how you start. It's how you finish. And I had a stat line like that pitching <laughs> against 15-year-olds when wow. I was 15. So, uh, wow, That's can cool. you imagine? Hey, Paul. Jeez. That's awesome.